Hey guys, it's Justin here from Jack Production Studios, and today I'm going to be doing a video on my LEGO Star Wars Mini Mock. So, yeah, you guys have probably, you guys saw this in my last vlog if you watched it. So, uh, yeah, this is a pretty cool Mini Mock, I like it. I'm not quite sure the planet, but, um, it'll be in the title. I'm considering a few, a few planets, but I have not finalized which planet it's on yet. So, don't worry about that, that'll, yeah, be done, but, uh, yeah. So, let's get right on into it. So, I'm gonna start with the uh, scenery, I guess. And actually, the backstory. Because this actually does include something from the Clone Wars. So, yeah. As you guys can see, there's Darth Maul and. Uh, Darth Maul and Savage. Well, yeah, Savage and Darth Maul. But, yeah. Um, now, yeah, if you guys are wondering what that is, that's just my recording area. Oh, this is like my mock and. Yeah, whatever. I, put, I record view, reviews and stuff and mocks. But, anyways, so, uh, yeah. This, uh, takes place after Season 4, but before, like, Season 5, uh, when Darth Maul was first shown, I guess. It, this is before they wanted, uh, Obi-Wan to come to them. Be oh, this is before, in Season 5, when Savage and Darth Maul wanted Obi-Wan to come to them. So they they were hunting him. It's giving us some backstory. So I, f I felt like just having Savage and Darth Maul in for some reason... I just got convinced by people on Skype, as in, I think I mentioned Darth Maul, and then, yeah, oh no, whatever, <laughs> Andrew was talking about something, about Savage crushing a bunch of clones, but anyways, uh, yeah, so, yeah, there's, uh, rock work, and grass, and everything, and there's different colored grass -y areas, but, uh, yeah, so, I'm gonna start off, this is probably, like, the main thing you guys probably saw, like the river and then the waterfall. I really do like it. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. It's my first attempt at a waterfall. So, uh, yeah. I, mean, I wanted to fix up that area behind the studs, but uh, I can't do much with that. So, the green plate is exposed behind the studs. It's not like the, the studs are covering it, but they're not bricks, so, you know. But, uh, yeah. So, then there's water going down this way, and, yeah. The water's uh, darker down here because this leads into the ocean. Just want to let you guys know that. That's why there's sand and that's why it goes out. It's, yeah, whatever. So it leads into an ocean-ish area. I don't know. And I just saw that there's a piece of gra grass that needs fixing. Yeah, there's a few pieces of grass that I need to put back up because of... Whatever. If you guys see grass lying around, it's not that big of a deal. It's just not placed right. But anyways. Sorry, I'm just fixing something I just knocked over. Alright. So... Yeah. Ooh, okay, <laughs> everything's fixed. Um, yeah. So there's grass and the water and sand leading into the ocean. And there's this kind of semi-hill-ish area. This is a cliff, but you guys might be thinking, oh, that's definitely not natural because it just just cut in. So, uh, yeah. It's kind of not like that because there's a hidden entrance into the base. But no one really cares to check behind a waterfall. And I guess it could have also it could also be because the water you know eroded the uh, rock, or ca oh yeah caused erosion in the rock. Ero yeah, whatever. So uh yeah, if I used that properly, I am not even really thinking right now. But yeah, so enough with that in the story. So yeah, there's more grass up here. There's Darth Maul uh killing or like fighting an airborne trooper. And there's another clone in the water. So if the lighting's in the way, I can adjust it. I don't know. But uh yeah. Then there's an air another airborne trooper. Another one. Okay. Light. Oh, yeah. If you're that LED or other light, you know, fine. Go away. Right. You cost too much light. Anyways, yeah. I just apologize. Yeah. So there's uh, Savage killing or yeah, fighting off a few more clones. Then there's more grass, and then there's the water. And there's the uh, whatever. It's the bubbles or whatever in the water. So yeah. I did use some slope work on the mountains, it's not, oh, hill, it's not really my best work. It's not, it's, I'm new to this, it's better than my last mountain I made, and that's better than my last waterfall, because I made a waterfall. So, uh, yeah. Now I'm going to remove the top. Yes, you guys can see everything, but I just want to point out, there is an entrance into a base. A bunker. So yeah, that's the entrance. It's kind of hidden, you know, but it's kind of noticeable. It's just... Alright, I'm going to remove that now. It's kind of simple, but I kind of want to do it with both hands so I don't destroy anything. You guys probably understand. 
All right, it's removed. Let's put that down. Take off my lanyard. It's kind of annoying me. And we'll bring the mock a bit forward, you know, so you guys can see everything. All right, so here we are. Yeah, just ignore this. This is some underwork, and I didn't really. I don't know why you saw a red brick there. I should have used a dark tan. A dark, dark tan. What? Uh, dark gray. Dark light. Oh, dark blue. It's gray. Wow, I'm messing up. So, uh, yeah, there are a bunch of clones ready to uh, fire at Savage and Darth Maul if they decide to go down the ladder. Take to the base. Yeah, there's obviously those two right there because the roof doesn't cover the entire thing. It's broken off at a certain point. But, uh, yeah, so there's Cody and a few 212 troopers. Obi-Wan's running to get up the stairs, you know, to provide support. Because they are after Obi-Wan, so he feels like it's his need to uh, help them. There's a gun rack. This is more of a bunker, I guess. I don't know. It's not really... Its purpose isn't for a base, you know. I guess it's a hideout. And then there's a bunch of computers here. And then there's another gun rack. And I do like the um, grill pieces that are covering the floor. It's pretty cool. There's some crates over there for storage. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this mock. I mean, there's not much else to show you guys. I think... Okay, no, the light on my camera is on. Right, yeah, no. Okay. <laughs> that was a derp moment. But, uh, yeah. So, oh, I just want to point this out. There is a little walk area leading over to there, to the waterfall. It's not really too much, but... Yeah, yeah, there's a way to get into the waterfall. There's a way to enter if you just, like, dive through the water. That's what I was trying to say. So I'm gonna put the roof back on right now. Uh, yeah. So this was a mock that took me about a week to make. If I'd started right after my other base, it would took, I would've had this out, like, last weekend, but... Yeah, I didn't start it right, Actually, I did kind of start this right afterwards. I had my other base done for a little while, and plus, yeah. Uh, let me just pack it back on. Yeah, so, um, hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to rate, comment, subscribe. And this was my, uh... Oh, okay, just adjusting my LED light. This was my Lego Star Wars, uh, mini mock. So, yeah, it's a one grade base built mock, by the way, if you're wondering the size. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to rate, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.